Goodwill Community Foundation, creating opportunities for a better life. If you're just getting started with Windows, learning how to navigate the interface is a great place to start. Let's take a look at the desktop, which is the screen you see here. It includes a desktop background, also known as your wallpaper, and the taskbar at the bottom of the screen. The taskbar is where you'll find shortcuts to some of the applications on your computer, as well as the Start button. In most versions of Windows, you can click the Start button to see a list of applications, files, and settings. But if you're using Windows 8, you can click the Start button to return to the Start screen. The taskbar is also where you'll find File Explorer, which allows you to view and open files and folders. For now, I'm going to close the window by clicking the X. Let's check out more features on the desktop instead. The desktop is the main workspace for your computer. To open a program, file, or folder, just double-click the icon. Each time you want to open something, it will appear in a new window. You have the ability to move windows by clicking and dragging the top of the window. When you're done, just release the mouse. If you have more than one window open at a time, you can quickly switch between them by clicking the icon for that window on the taskbar. Almost all windows allow you to maximize the window so that it fills the entire screen. Just click the button here. Click the button again to return the window to its original size. When you're finished, closing the window is easy. Just click the X. That covers the basics. Now that you know your way around Windows, you can start taking advantage of everything it has to offer.